And they were camping out early this morning since last night for this one. And now our tip. All right, let's check out our starting lineups. They're brought to you by Dove Men Plus Care. Strother, Hickman, Bolton, Timmy, and Watson. Yeah, Cal felt like that. Timmy had that left hook, which he spins baseline on, as well as anyone in the country working for him. Strother at three. It's too easy. That is absolutely too easy to start the ball game. To start the ball game, look what, just a simple out of bounds play for Julian Strother to run from the weak side to the top of the key. That's the shot early that Gonzaga wants Kentucky to take. Severe Wheeler with an early three. Timmy flips it up and it rolls in. Gain rebounding by the guys in white. Timmy eyeing up, goes to the basket and throws it down. Oh and a hand double, that's not going to stop anybody, especially well, his hand strength and his hand speed is phenomenal for a true freshman. Look out. Good lob finds Lance Ware for the throwdown. Just a, and then comes right down and very patient playing in the pro lane line slot, finds Lance Ware on the backside. Watson kicks out Strother. Feed inside and a great seal and a great look, Watson. With the deuce. Kick to the corner. Frederick can shoot it. A little short for the Iowa transfer. Might have been deflected. Kick up ahead. Timmy runs the floor. Developing as a defensive guy as well. I mean, he gets a piece of that basketball, which starts the run game. And Drew Timmy just outruns a guy, Lance, where they can really run. And terrific, terrific soft pause by Timmy from Chattanooga, who's the SoCon Player of the Year, and now with the Zags. There he is with the basketball. Inside, trying to find some space, does, puts it in. Timmy wide open. Rebound, Gonzaga. Strother a three. Bam. Reeves, I thought he might have been trying to lob it for Shibwe, who gets the offensive rebound, and then throws it down. Look out. Timmy, wow. Oh, wow. that's a move right that there. Is special. In a big time game, and Drew Timmy in the middle third of the floor. Such a playmaker that you run. Shebley rebounds the Strother miss as Kentucky into the front court. Wallace puts it on the floor, wide open lane to the basket. At the COVID final four. Yep. <laughs> yeah, they were partners. <laughs> Watson. Wow. Oh! On Kentucky right here, it's a dribble handoff action, and Kentucky gets confused. Are we switching? Are we sticking? Toppin thinks we're switching, and Reeves thinks we're, that we're not. And all of a sudden... Yeah, that's going to have to change if the Wildcats are going to get back into it. Bolt turns the corner, flips it up off the glass, and in. Rajir Bolt. So far, most of the players have been able to maintain footing. Shot clock under 10, and Frederick buries one. That's the first three of the game for Kentucky. Oh, wow. I understand from a coaching standpoint when you finally throw one in, the jubilation. <laughs> Jimmy on the floor, puts it up and in. Well, there he is, and one. Drew Timmy, he'll go to the line. He is a handful. Yeah, hard to guard. I mean, he drives down that pro lane line. His ability to stop, bam, right there and pivot quickly, so impressive for a kid his size. That's one thing about basketball, man. How, how well can you stop is vastly underrated. Dollar Shave Club, that's one of his, which is funny for the big <laughs> Yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah. Inside Wheeler, and one. Win the possession right here. Bam. Severe Wheeler drives that ball just outside the elbow. And a block there. Offense looks different without Oscar on the floor, though, right? Good feed inside as Wheeler able to find his man. Kentucky will go five out with Oscar on the bench, but Lance were up top. The ability to run the offense. Bolton with the hesitation, and then hangs wow. and hits. Roger Bolton, that is a nice move. 
Jimmy gives off Bolton. Shot clock under 10. Jimmy with deep position. And it knocked away and a turnover. Yeah, he opened up and pivoted right into the arms of Sheboy. Pretty quick when you're up 10 and you feel the momentum in the building starting to slide a little. Redrick left hand. Sheboy offensive rebound and a two-hand stub. Major impact in this game. He lives at the front of the rim. Knocks people out of the way. He bowls as much as he plays basketball. Frederick's shoe is still not totally on. No, it's not. Shot clock under five. And that one knocked down at a biggie by Casey Wallace. And all of a sudden, it's a five-point game. Timmy gets the step in the bucket. And he's in downhill mode on the catch, really putting Oscar Shibwe in a bind. And Reeves drills one from deep. The special teams of TCU yesterday, right? Run that field goal team out there, kick that thing for a game winner. Wallace buries a three. And now four for their last nine. Timmy goes opposite, finds Bolton, who knocks it down. Rajir Bolton. And the pass by Timmy, because he threw about a 25-foot pass. Right on the numbers. Top and off the bounce. 10.33 to go here, second half. Timmy, little hesitation. Absorbs some contact, left hand, and one. Because he is a driving, spinning, get you leaning and lunging offensive player. And he just, so now you're trying to put length on Drew Timmy and just stay between he and the basket. Timmy's got five since Shibwe went to the bench, but Toppin knocks down another shot. It feels like John Calipari is trying to get to the next media timeout before Shibwe comes back in at that under eight mark. That's just money. That is just money. Read the play from the defensive jersey up. Wheeler launches, Huge. hits. You cannot single coverage. What a cut, what a pass. Bam! Oh, and the follow there by Watson as well as any big guy in the country. Surveys the play. The hard cut behind the defense is what initiates the offense by Hunter Salas, who lives at the rim as a hard cutter. He gets the ball up initially, and the value of getting the ball on the rim. Wheeler had it stripped away. Now Strother, and then they get the foul on Wheeler. It's a little surprising, even with Drew Timmy, a 38-22 points of the paint advantage for Gonzaga. The Toppin has found his stroke, another bucket. In the other tournament, Reeves not able to hit. Salas pulls it away. Salas at the basket and puts it in. He has hyper speed in the open floor, does Salas. Wallace able to get that one to go. Casey Wallace. Bolton at the basket, and that's good. 39 points and 19 rebounds combined. This is his hot spot. Kentucky did a good job of coming with that double team low. Hopping with the ball, 10 of his 14 in the second half. And that'll go, make it 12 of his 16 since the break. His game is a fallible game. The spin, the speed, the ball handling ability for a kid his size. Wallace a little unsure, but Chibwe not. Bolton. Yeah, can't and go on. Drains that. Boogie you can't go under. The game's on the line, man. Loose ball. Hickman dives on it. It'll go possession arrow, and it belongs to the Zach. But they got on top of Kentucky shooters. They made Oscar Sheepway work for everything. And they really negated the drive ability of Kentucky in this game. And Kentucky's inability to stop the drive. And that's to see any event, concert, rodeo, Hockey, track basketball, ball. whatever. <laughs> and the exclamation point there. And how about Bolton finishes with 24 as that one rattles in. 
Well, good. they hadn't played here at Spokane Arena since 2014. They needed a win, and they got it. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.